Hello dear students this is your Dr Sirajuddin again and today i have come up with the lecture 5 and in the lecture 5 we'll be dealing with some common terminologies of irrigation so before i start this lecture please subscribe your own youtube channel that is agri tutorial so without much ado let us start today's chapter for you so the first term is absolute transpiration so absolute transpiration means that rate of water loss from a plant which is basically determined experimentally in the lab okay so absolute transpiration kya hua wo transpiration basically jo ki hum experimentally determine karte hain okay so and transpiration you know that it is the water loss in the vapor form from the plant or from the vegetative part so the rate of water loss from a plant which is determined experimentally is known as absolute transpiration okay moving on the second uh, term is absolute water requirement okay so this first of all this absolute water requirement is also known as the consumptive use of water so when i say consumptive use of water is it is equal to et plus you know the water which is used in the metabolic activities to jitna bhi pani aapka evapotranspiration mein use ho raha hai plus jitna bhi pani aapka metabolic activities mein use ho raha hai uska sum ko hum consumptive use bolte hain and mo mostly it has been experienced or it has been researched out that only less than 1% of the water is used in the metabolic activities and that's why this consumptive use is you know uh like equal or uh, somewhat equal to et losses okay so <clears throat> the quantity of the quantity of water in hectare centimeter per crop season absorbed by the crop together with the evaporation from the crop producing land तो वो वाटर जो कि हम हेक्टर सेंटीमीटर्स में ले रहे हैं द वाटर और द क्वांटिटी ऑफ वाटर इन द हेक्टर सेंटीमीटर पर क्रॉप सीजन जो कि एक क्रॉप सीजन के लिए पर क्रॉप सीजन के लिए हम यू नो ले रहे हैं और दैट हैज बीन एब्जॉर्ब बाय द क्रॉप एंड विद दैट वी आर वी आर आल्सो टेकिंग द इवेपोरेशन यू नो द पार्ट ऑफ इवेपोरेशन ऑल्सो हेयर सो सिंपल द क्वांटिटी ऑफ वाटर इन हेक्टर सेंटीमीटर per crop season absorbed by the crop together with the evaporation from the crop producing land is known as absolute water requirement okay now the another term is acre foot of water okay so you it is very easy <clears throat> now you see it is the amount of water that would cover an acre of land to a depth of 1 foot assuming no seepage evaporation and run off losses to agar hum ye assume karke chalein ki kisi area mein seepage nahi ho raha hai evaporation nahi ho raha hai aur run off losses nahi ho rahe to wo amount of water jo ki ek acre ko cover up karega or to a depth of 1 foot that will be known as acre foot of water okay now moving on the another term is allowable soil water depletion okay so the depth of soil water in the root zone readily available to the crop for given soil and climate allowing unrestricted evapotranspiration as the fraction of total available soil water between fill capacity and building and it is not building point it is wilting point okay it is wilting point so it is expressed as millimeters per meter to ab aap isko samajhiye ki allowable soil water depletion to pehli baat to aapko ye samajhna hai ki humne yahan pe do reference liye field capacity and wilting point okay to field capacity se leke jo wilting point ke beech ka jo moisture hota hai that is the available moisture to that depth of the soil water in the root zone which is readily available which is readily available to the crop for a particular soil and climate okay to ek particular soil ki location or particular climate mein jo jitna bhi depth of soil water ek particular root zone mein readily available hoga crop ke liye and allowing unrestricted evapotranspiration aur usse kya hoga ki aapka evapotranspiration unrestricted rahega it means it will be to the full fledged and it is the fraction of that total available soil water which exists between the field capacity and 
वेल्टिंग पॉइंट तो सिंपल सी बात है अवेलेबल अगर हम इसको सिंपल टर्म्स में समझें कि आपका जो अवेलेबल वाटर का वो फ्रैक्शन जो कि रेडिली अवेलेबल हो जाए क्रॉप को दैट विल बी नोन एज अवेलेबल सॉइल वाटर डिप्लीशन सिंपल ओके सो इट इज एक्सप्रेस इन मिलीमीटर्स पर मीटर ओके नाउ अगेन अवेलेबल वाटर इज दी एन अदर टर्म विच आई हैव जस्ट यू नो लाइक डिस्कस सो इट इज द मॉइस्चर रेंज और द लिमिट which is available to the plant okay and that's why the name is given available water which lies between field capacity and wilting point of a soil to so, field capacity or wilting point ke beech mein jitna bhi moisture range hai ya moisture limit hai which is available to the plant is known as available water okay now another term is barrage okay so barrage i think it is very common word but certainly we don't you know Uh, know the actual meaning of it so barrage means a large structure which is erected across a river in order to store water usually for irrigation to ek bada sa structure jo ki hum river ke across erect karte hain so and what is the objective of that structure is to you know store the water so that it can be used for the irrigation usually so that structure is known as barrage okay then moving on bound water is the another term so the form of water that is adsorb so here i am using adsorb not absorb okay the form of water that is adsorb strongly by colloids is known as bound water to so colloids pe jitna bhi pani that form of water which is tightly adsorbed or strongly adsorbed on the soil colloid is known as bound water so this water is retained against the forces of evaporation of over 1000 atmosphere to so, agar ye adsorb hua hai to this water is retained you know against the force of evaporation okay and that force of evaporation is near about 1000 atmosphere now the another term is crop root zone so simple the soil depth from which a mature crop extracts most of the water needed for evapotranspiration to wo soil depth jisse ki ek mature crop apna most of the pani you know water jo ki usko evapotranspiration ke liye chahiye extract karti hai that depth is known as crop root zone okay then another very क्यू वेरी यू नो लाइक कॉमन टर्म क्यू सिक बट स्टूडेंट्स को कभी कभार इसमें यू नो समझने में दिक्कत हो जाती है तो लेट मी क्लैरिफाई दिस क्यू सिक मीन्स दैट क्वान्टिटी ऑफ वाटर विच इज फ्लोइंग एट द रेट ऑफ क्यूबिक फुट पर सेकेंड ओके तो क्यूबिक फुट पर सेकेंड को ही हम क्या बोलते हैं क्यू सिक बोलते हैं एंड ऑलवेज रिमेंबर वन क्यूबिक फुट ऑफ वाटर वेज अराउंड सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फोर पाउंड्स और इट इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी एट पॉइंट थ्री फोर लीटर्स ओके तो क्यूबिक फुट पर सेकेंड इज नोन एज क्यूसेक ओके और ये पूछा भी जाता है आपके कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स में इवन द यू नो फैक्ट विच आई हैव जस्ट डिस्कस दैट वन क्यूबिक फुट ऑफ वाटर इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटी टू पॉइंट फाइव एल बी एस दैट इज पाउंड्स एंड ट्वेंटी एट पॉइंट थ्री फाइव लीटर इट इज ऑल्सो आर्ग्स फ्रिक्वेंटली इन द एग्जामिनेशन ओके देन मूविंग ऑन डे क्यूसेक okay the quantity of water in the cusex which is flowing for 24 hours simple to so, cusex abhi humne samjha to so, quantity of water which we have taken in you know in terms of cusex and which is flowing for 24 hours that will be referred as day cusex okay then dam to so, one term we have discussed is barrage and the another one is dam okay तो डैम आप सभी ने सुना हुआ वर्ड है आपका तो अ बैरियर विच इज कंस्ट्रक्टेड अक्रॉस अ रिवर कोर्स फॉर वेरीड पर्पजेज सच एज क्रिएटिंग अ रिजर्व तो ऐसा बैरियर जो कि हम रिवर के अक्रॉस कंस्ट्रक्ट करते हैं और उसका पर्पज बहुत कुछ हो सकता है ओके तो इट कैन हैव वेरियस यू नो पर्पजेज लाइक सच एज क्रिएटिंग अ रिजर्व then creating a head which can be used for irrigation and for generating power or electricity etc so that is termed as dam okay then effective rainfall okay so the fraction of total precipitation that forms the soil water reserve for consumptive use of crop or that becomes available for crop production is known as effective rainfall 
तो टोटल प्रेसिपिटेशन में से वो फ्रैक्शन ऑफ प्रेसिपिटेशन जो कि पर्टिकुलरली आपका सॉइल वाटर रिजर्व फॉर्म करेगा एंड दैट विल बी यूटिलाइज बाय द प्लांट्स एज सच फॉर द कंजप्टिव यूज और सिंपली दैट दैट वाटर विल बी अवेलेबल फॉर द क्रॉप प्रोडक्शन सो दैट फ्रैक्शन ऑफ द प्रेसिपिटेशन और द रेनफॉल व्हिच फॉर्म्स द सॉइल वाटर रिजर्व इज नोन एज इफेक्टिव रेनफॉल ओके so this is uh, all about uh, for the today's lecture i hope uh, you know you have liked the lecture so if you have liked the lecture please do share and comment and subscribe your own youtube youtube channel agri tutorial and if you have any certain queries you can ask me in the comment section and i know ki ye bahut dino baad ek uh, video aaya and there is a problem because my laptop has been damaged so as soon as i get my laptop back i'll you know i'll 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 assure you that you know i assure you i'll uh, give you you know daily uh, one video as i used to give you so this is all for the day thank you very much class